would say I actually thought it was one of the best sessions I've been at in a while, and I'll tell you why. I think the conversation is moving in the industry from the nuts and bolts and the technical to now a conversation about change, which is, for me, the choice of IT. IT has always been about change for me. The change is now not about the introduction of hardware and software. The change is now about the way in which the business interacts with IT. And I think that that, um, to, to find in the group that the group was moving in that direction was for me permanent, uh, personally very reinforcing and very affirming. So that was great. And, and I think it's opened the doors to a couple of other relationships for me that I will probably continue the conversation long outside the room. So that's great. Excellent networking. Yeah, I think there's two things. I, I think the first, um, the first thing from my perspective is that human resources are in limited supply. And the reality is the change for us for those of us who've been in IT 20 or 30 years, the reasons we got into IT are now no longer the same reasons that we're staying in IT. And yet, we've put in 20 or 30 years of, of great loyal service to various employers, and more importantly, to the industry as a whole. So for me, that ought to count for something. And so part of that is the conversation about bringing the opportunity for people to who've made a great contribution already and who understand the business and who understand the the legacy side of the conversation to make that great contribution in the space around integration and in the space around uh, bringing together multiple vendors which is really now the challenges in today's world so part of it to me is just a sensible response to a limited supply of people but it's also about i think that the lessons we're teaching the young folks is that there isn't a sense of loyalty and there isn't a sense of mutual obligation between the staff member and the organization, I don't think that that's a good sustainable message. And so for me, I think it's about how do we repair some of the damage we've done on the way to speed by simply slashing and burning people along the way. I don't think that that's a great sustainable message. And so it, for those two reasons, I think it's an important, an important conversation. I think there's a great skill set to be tapped but I think there's a very limited supply of people. And finally, I would say we've got to create a willingness for those um, younger folks to choose us as employers. And I think that if we can't show that there's an equal exchange of respect and, and dependability without um, golden handcuffs or without that kind of, you'll always be okay if you do nothing but breathe, I think it's a fairer exchange and I, and I think it's just good business.